God thanks you are super and wants you to make good choices. I'm reading you today about my great big veggie storybook with lessons from God's word. The, the good, the bad, and the silly. Bong. Bong. The clock struck high noon. Cowboy Larry, Cowboy Larry w was shaken. Cowboy Larry, Cowboy Larry, <clears throat> Cowboy Larry, bong. The clock struck kind of Cowboy Larry was shaken in his boots. It was the day of his big cattle drive test at Cowboy School. Sheriff Bob. The cattle drive teacher glanced at the names on his clipboard. Next up, Cowboy Larry, Fox Scallion, and the Sunburn Kid. He said, Cowboy Larry's heart pounded like a hammer. It was his turn. It was a tough test. Cowboy Larry would need to move 40 cows from one ranch to another. If he was fast enough, he would pass. If he was a slow poke, he would fail. And to make things even tougher, this was a team test, and Larry's test-taking teammates were none other than those rascals bought Scallion and the Sunburn Kid. Howdy, partners, Cowboy Larry said to Botch and Sunburn. Botch snared, snarled, snarled as crabby as a cow poke with a cactus in his pants, but the Sunburn Kid didn't answer at all. He was too busy trying to cover his, his his belly with sunscreen. Splurt. The sunscreen splattered. The sunscreen splattered. Cowboy Larry in the nose instead. Oops, sorry, said the sunburn kid. Cowboy Larry really wanted to pass the cattle drive test. After all, he didn't do very well on his advance. Lucy saying test the week before, you know how it works, said Bob. You've got to move those cows from the okie dokie coral and around Dodgeball Canyon. Get them to the ranch dressing ranch by sundown and you pass. Sounds good. Let's round him up, shouted Cowboy Larry. But, but, Botch just growled. The sunburn kid didn't say a word because he was too busy putting t-shirts on the cows to keep the sun off their backs. The cattle drive test started out wonderfully. Cowboy Larry rode alongside the cows, shutting, sh shutting cowboy things like rolling, 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 keep them doggies moving. Even though they were cows and not dogs, but they near Dodgeball Canyon. Botch led the cattle off the trail and down into the canyon. Oh, uh, Mr. Botch, aren't we supposed to take the cows around Dodgeball Canyon? asked Cowboy Larry. This is a shortcut, muttered Botch. 
But cutting through dodgeball canyon would be cheating. And Calvin Lord God has a problem with it too. But cheating gets good grades, said Botch. Isn't that true, Sunburn? The Sunburn kid didn't answer. Cowboy Larry knew that taking a shortcut through Dodgeball Canyon wouldn't just be cheating, it would be dangerous. Mountain lions prowled the canyon, and if they made too much noise, they could trigger a deadly avalanche of dodgeballs. Cowboy Larry wasn't sure what to do. Should he do the good thing and say no to the others? Should he do the bad thing and follow Botch and the Sunburn Kid? Or should he do the silly things and help Sunburn put hats and sunglasses on the cows to protect their eyes from the sun? Simon Sa- 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 snarled, sna- snarled Botch who... It's even gonna know we cheated. Well, okay, said Cowboy Larry. He decided to follow Botch and the Sunburn Kid, but Cowboy Larry felt rotten about it. So they led the cows into the deadly, de- deadly dodgeball canyon. Brothers? Puzzled overhead, lizards lounged around in the sun. Tumbleweed turned, tumbled by, and the sunburned kid nearly got bit trying to put sunscreen on rattlesnakes. Growled. What was that? asked the sunburned kid. Gulp in, glancing around. Don't worry, snarled Botch, even though he knew it might be a growling mountain lion. Growl. Growl, 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 growl. There, there, there it is again, gasped Sunburn. I don't like this botch. By this time, Cowboy Larry knew he had made the wrong choice, but he he also realized that it wasn't too late to change his mind. It's never too late to do the good thing. You ask his gun to know if we cheat, Cowboy Larry said to Bodge, well, I don't know, and so will God. So I'm turning around, and are you coming with me or not? Good riddance, grumbled Botch. Adios, amigos. But as Cowboy Larry rode out of the Dodgeball Canyon, Botch and Sunburn Kid suddenly heard it again. Growl! 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 Grr! 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 Botch rolled his eyes that isn't a mountain lion growling. He said, Sunburn, that's your stomach growling. Gee, I think you're right, said Sunburn. I knew I, I should have ordered free flap jack breakfast this morning at Clint's Covered Wagon Cafe. Grr, 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 grr. Cows are not especially smart. The more they heard Sunburn's stomach growling, the more afraid they became. They were sure it was the sound of growling mountain lions. Finally, one of the cows couldn't take it any longer, terrified. And she ran, and when one cow bolted, all of them did. Stampity shouted, Bolch, Bolch. The, the cattle thundered across the land, kicking up dust. They shook 
the ground like an earthquake. The the result ample lunch and slammed the sunburn kids. Thousands of dodgeballs came crashing down from the hot hills, burning the cowboys and bouncy rubber balls. Cowboy and Larry got out of the canyon just before the avalanche. When the dust settled, he was able to gallop back and throw a rope to botch and sunburn. He pulled them out of the dodgeballs and he got the crowds out to hip hop, hip hip, hooray, hip hip, hooray, hip hip, hooray. Cowboy and Larry had saved the day. Good thing I didn't stay with you guys. He told Botch and Sunburn, Cowboy and Larry had learned to follow God rather than follow the crown or the herd. It was dark by the time they returned to the Okie Dokie Coral. Miss Katie, the cowboy school owner, handed root beers to the tired cowboys. I'm sorry, said Sheriff Bob. I can't give you your cattle drive license today. Cowboy Larry was as happy as could be. Although he didn't pass a cattle drive test, he had passed a more important test. He didn't cheat. Cowboy Larry had made the good choice after all. Sunburn, the sunburn kid, meanwhile, didn't mind that they had failed. Night had fallen in the wild, wild west. And he was too busy sniff smearing moonscreen on his face. Spurt, oops, sorry, he said to Cowboy Larry. And he said to Cowboy Larry, Think, do not follow the crowd when they do what is wrong. Exodus 23 2. Think about this. When your friends misbehave, do you tell them to stop or do you go along with the crowd? Usually it is much easier to go along with the crowd or to say nothing at all. But that's the wrong thing to do. It's better to stand up for what you know is right. God's world is a wonderful place. But people who misbehave can spoil things in a hurry. So if your friends behave poorly, don't copy them. Instead, do the right thing. You'll be... Super glad you did, and so will God. Super words and promises for a super you. Our God is a God of second chances. It's never too late to take the right path. You never have to be uh, afraid to do what's right. Questions to talk about with your super mom and dad. What are some choices you make every day? How can you help your friends make better choices? A prayer. Dear God, help me to make super choices every day. Arise, shine, Zoe. Arise, shine, Zoe, for your light has come, and the glory of the Lord rises upon you. Zoe dwells in the shelter of the Most High, will rest in the shadow of the mighty. The Lord watches over you, Zoe, and the Lord is your shade at your right hand. Zoe, the Lord will watch over your coming and going, both now and, and forevermore. So the message about the Lord spread widely in a powerful and have a powerful effect. Zoe. So the message about the Lord spread widely and power and had a powerful effect. Zoe, the Lord is merciful and compassionate. So to get angry and filled with unfallen love. God loves you. God cares for you. God is there for you every step of the way. In the name of Jesus.
Bye-bye. Please like, share, subscribe, send me a friend request from Facebook.